owner is like mm, i like this cargo okay uh, uh, why don't you touch base with the charter hi everyone jai hind jai bharat jai mata di so this is the next video and this is what is ship broking to kunal ji please give us some insight on ship broking hi everyone sorry for barging in between i hope you like the video the question as well as where this video is going please keep watching the video but most important don't forget to go into the description box and go to the complete series watch in detail every video learn as much as possible make your notes and make your future bright jai hind jai bharat jai mata di okay what i'll do is that i'll make it very easy for you guys to understand what actually ship broking so uh, pranit you must have bought property at one point of your life at one, one point of your time maybe flat so maybe land something right not lands not flats one house okay i know no, you've been very <laughs> humble i know <laughs> okay. so uh, now broker is a broker broker is basically a mediator he is an intermediary between two parties so you can take broker anywhere and everywhere so what is happening is that if you are going to buy a property there is a buyer and there is a seller so they have got two options either they can talk directly or they can talk to broker now what is the benefit of talking with a broker is that broker will have hundreds of the options now buyer we need just one property seller will have just one property but the broker will have hundreds of properties and hundreds of people with him so the benefit of getting attached with the broker is that you expand your options you have more options in your kitty so uh, whenever somebody is looking for a property he will ask for a broker that can you show me the land or can you show me the flat and then he will sit and then the mediation happen now let's take you across to ship same goes in ship brokering right now i'm talking about ship brokering i'm not talking about freight brokering that will be talking about later on now ship broker is a person who is an intermediary between a ship owner and a charterer now who is a ship owner ship owner is somebody who is the owner of a ship now what will he want that my ship runs continuously and my revenue is generated on a continuous basis right what will a charterer want now charterer is somebody who has got a cargo he has got a cargo maybe let's say australia in gladstone he has got a 50000 tons of coal in gladstone and he is looking to transport that cargo to india because he has got a deal with steel authority of india now steel authority of india wants that good to be transported now what do they want they want a ship now how will they get a ship either he can go directly to the owners but how many owners will he know he his main objective is to take care of the cargo ship it's not his job so what he'll do is that they will go to a broker now going to a broker is like uh, going to a man friday he will have lots and lots of options in his hand why because he's so well connected in the industry that he knows each and every person very well so what will happen is that charter will say i have got this cargo this place and i want to be it to be transported to there he said no problem sir then he will open his emails he will open his uh, basket of goodies he'll start opening the ship he'll say uh, uh, supermax no handymax no a uh, panamax yeah, yeah this is the best fit for him then what he'll do is that he'll contact the owner he'll contact the owner he'll say so there's a very good option for you this is the cargo which is there in gladstone perfectly matching because since you are in singapore i know it will take another four to five days to for you to reach out there this is the perfect time for you you won't waste, waste much of a time you won't waste much of a bunker fuel i'll uh, use the techno uh, technical terms which you'll get familiar with so uh, that will happen and then the owner will say okay in that case please show me the cargo then the broker will send the cargo the owner is like mm, i like this cargo okay uh, uh, why don't you touch base with the charter so now what will broker say okay sir can you send me the full detail of the ship because technically this is hidden thing vessel particulars you can find anywhere marine traffic uh, ship fix blah 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 anywhere and any side you will find but full detail which is known as tc description of the vessel which is only held by the owner and he will give only to those people whom he trusts so he passes the detail to the broker now broker gives this information to the charterer the charter will say okay this was a now the charter will ask his operations team to check whether this cargo is perfectly fit for the ship blah 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 calculation calculation yes sir perfect fit thank you sir done again goes back to broker please call him on lunch it means bringing on table so they sit on the table broker is sitting they are not actually sitting on table because somebody is in us somebody is in uh, uh, tokyo is like that then the business starts so basically broker is the most important component in shipping and in fact shipping is the only field where broker is needed by virtue of his experience anywhere else any field 
people will want to eliminate broker they will say no no we'll go direct shipping is one place because brokers are not just brokers they are uh, charters they are maritime lawyers they are port agents they are trained claim handlers they are surveyors they are auditors broker is like 100 man in one they are well trained people so which the owners and charter they trust they know if my vessel is stuck or my cargo is stuck anywhere this is one guy i want to talk to because talking directly will have legal implications so now broker is involved and he's a mediator which takes care of each and every aspect of shipping right Pani? that's quite an insight thank you captain kunal just one uh, yeah. thing like uh, I was uh, buying a flat and I had to pay flat 1% on the uh, the house that uh, I had the, bought the, for the brokerage uh, yeah, thing. Yeah, the commission. The Even deal. if you are going to Mumbai, you are buying a flat, you have to pay 3 months rent to the broker and then you get the flat. Any idea if you can just disclose ki how much does a broker, does the these guys, the owner or the charterer or both of them have to pay to the broker and how much is the... The commission. Person, commission, something okay. like that. Good please. question. Of course, there are no free lunches in the world. Broker doesn't do anything free of cost. So, uh, now broker works on commission. The best part about shipping is that the commission is standard world over. You go to Japan, you go to Germany, you go to France, you go to Italy, you go to US, you go to Australia. The commission is 1.25% of the fixture made. Be it freight or be it hire. Now, freight is per ton. Hire is per day. So whatever it is, he'll be getting a commission of 1.25% for the business done. So yeah. point, so half is paid by the owner, half is paid by the charter or always, yeah, who pays? No, the owner pays. Always the owner yes, pays. Yes, owner pays. As per, it depends, but 90% time it's the owner who pays for that. And it is technically deducted out of the freight and then it adds on the cost component. Okay. I know what is the next question. Uh, next, question know what the, next question is not going to come in the next series because then okay. I will be talking in details about this thing. Okay. So guys, this is the information that we wanted. Now next question will be on top ship broking firms in the world, which will be the next video. Thank you very much. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat, Jai Matar. I hope you like this video and if you want to know more about ship chartering and ship broking, what are you waiting for? Please enroll up for this free course of ours where you can find all the information about ship charting and ship broking. And yes, if some information is missing, do share it with us. What information do you need? And we'll be coming up with a separate video as well. Enroll for this course, get all the information. The link is in the description box as well as in the comment section. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat, Jai Matadi. Let us make well informed decisions. Take care. Bye.